Infectious mononucleosis is a common infection of the throat in young adults or adolescents. It is transmitted by saliva and it can be caused by kissing and so it is also called kissing disease or glandular fever. The features are sudden onset of sore throat, high fever, malaise, fatigue, difficulty in swallowing and on examination the ENT specialist will see a dirty white membrane on your tonsils. It is quite often mistaken for a bacterial tonsillitis and sometimes a wrong treatment can be started which causes complications and also a rash formation. The treatment is usually symptomatic, pain medication, fever medication, oral gargles and because it is a viral infection, antibiotics are not usually warranted unless it is to prevent a secondary infection. The diagnosis is made on the basis of examination, the clinical features of the patient and sometimes a blood test may be carried out which could be a CBC which reveals certain abnormalities in your lymphocytes or monocytes and sometimes a serological test for Epstein-Barr virus can be done to find out specifically about the infection. The disease runs a protracted course and can last for about 3 weeks to 4 weeks. There is initially intense pain in the throat and difficulty in swallowing so hydration and nutrition must be maintained in some manner or the other. In some cases, hospitalization is necessary, particularly if the patient cannot maintain nutrition or gets dehydrated. Infectious mononucleosis, also called glandular fever, is an infection of the tonsils and the upper respiratory tract by a virus, the Epstein-Barr virus. In young adults, it is a common problem and can be diagnosed on the basis of clinical features and some investigations that we carried out.